This is a set of close-up lenses from Tiffin. There are three in this kit. A plus one, a plus two, and a plus four. For those that don't know, close-up lenses are really just diopters. You place it over the lens and it lessens the minimum focus distance by the amount specified. So essentially you're turning it into a quasi macro lens. Now, why would you use a diopter? Well, the main reason would be to get tighter close-up shots that are in focus. Using this anamorphic lens, it's a fairly wide lens. So using the wide lens, you won't see as much of a dramatic difference. But you could also put the rig on the tele lens of the iPhone and you'll get some tighter looks and some different results. And one thing I am finding is you are getting more shallow depth of field and thus you're seeing more bokeh. Now before we get too far, I just wanna say quickly that this is a prototype lens and I'm using the original Beast Grip Pro. They have a newer mount for the iPhone 11 Pro that I actually do not have right now. And then once their Beast Cage comes out, that'll even be a better solution to use this combination. And so in saying that, you will see some soft edges and some chromatic aberration. That is not an indication of how this lens will actually work once it's released. The purpose of this video today is really just to experiment with diopters and see what kind of difference they can make on these wider anamorphic lenses. And by the way, you could also try this with the Moondog and Moment lenses as well. You would just need to use their proprietary filter mounts. Now keep in mind, these are more or less like filters. They are screw on and they are not multi-coated. And so they are not like a real macro lens, but they're an affordable option that can act like one. And then of course, also remember that you can stack these just like with filters. And so you would put these together. That's a plus four and a plus two. You would have even more of a close up look. Okay, this is the standard lens. No diopter on there. That's the plus one. Plus one. That's the plus two. Plus two diopter. And that's the plus four. And then here is the plus four and the plus two together. This is the anamorphic by itself. That's the plus one. That's the plus two. And here's the plus four.
telephoto with the plus four diopter. And then here's the same shot with the plus two and plus four stack. Same shot with no diopter, just the anamorphic on the iPhone Tele. One thing you'll notice is when you stack these filters, the image quality does tend to soften up a little bit. These diopters will soften the image regardless, but when you stack them, you are losing more quality. And so one thing I need to look into doing is getting a plus 10 diopter. This particular kit only came with the three I've shown. So I think these diopters are really pretty cool. I love that you can get tighter in on footage using these wider lenses and that you can see a little more shallow depth of field. So if you've never played with close-up lenses like this, I would recommend trying them out. This kit was only 39 US dollars. Thanks for watching guys. This is Blake Calhoun. Please like, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.